whenever a traumatized vascular wall or traumatized extravascular tissues come in contact with blood, the extrinsic pathway for initiating formation of prothrombin activator begins. Tissue trauma releases a complex of several factors called tissue factor or tissue thromboplastin. Tissue factor is composed especially of phospholipids from the membranes of the tissue and a lipoprotein complex. The main function of this lipoprotein complex is to act like a proteolytic enzyme. The lipoprotein complex of tissue factor further complexes with blood coagulation factor VII. As a result, factor VII is converted into activated factor VII. So, here we can say that in presence of tissue factor, the factor VII is converted into activated factor VII. In the next step, tissue factor in combination with activated factor VII acts enzymatically on a biochemical reaction in which factor X is converted into activated factor X or XA. This biochemical reaction occurs in presence of calcium ions. In the next step, the activated factor X combines immediately with tissue phospholipids of tissue factors or with additional phospholipids released from platelets as well as with factor V to form the complex called prothrombin activator. This biochemical reaction also occurs in presence of calcium ions. In the next step, within a few seconds, in presence of calcium ions, prothrombin activator causes splitting of prothrombin to form thrombin and the clotting process proceeds. At first, the factor V in the prothrombin activator complex is inactive. But once the clotting begins, the thrombin begins to form and the proteolytic action of thrombin activates factor V. The activated factor V then becomes an additional strong accelerator of prothrombin activation. Thus, in the final prothrombin activator complex, activated factor X is the actual protease that causes splitting of prothrombin to form thrombin. Activated factor V greatly accelerates the protease activity of activated factor X. Platelet phospholipids acts as a vehicle that further accelerates the process. Now, an important point. The positive feedback effect of thrombin acting through factor V to accelerate the entire process once it begins. Please like, subscribe and share.